Hi guys, thank you for tuning in to my video. Today we're going to do another um, fall eyeshadow look and this is the dramatic red look. And basically it's a red smoky eye so if you do not have a um, any type of red um, eyeshadow then I'm sorry you may not be able to do this tutorial. But basically, I'm getting my red from my BH Cosmetics 88 palette. And, um, yeah. So, as always, I always prime my eyelid. And today, I am priming my eyelid with the Eyes, Lips, Face Eyelid Primer in Pearl. So, basically, what you want to do is you just want to get a lot of it on your eyelid so that way the color will stay on longer um, the color will go on smoother you also want to make sure that um, you put eyelid on especially if you use like if you get um, a red that's not very well pigmented you want the colors to stay on so after priming your eyelid Take your um, eye shader brush. Mine is, has already been used because obviously I did this eye. So just take it and get your red if you're using the BH Cosmetics 88 palette. It's all the way at the bottom. And what I like to do is I like to dab on my color. I don't like to, I rub color on, but I try not to rub it on a lot because that fades the color out and you don't want the color fading out you want the color to pop so sorry about my camera I am working on fixing that okay so after you get color onto your lid um, the next step is that you need a black eyeshadow. So, um, if you're using the 88 BH Cosmetics palette, it would be this color right here where my brush is. And I'm using an angle brush, and it's a reason for that. You're not going to put black all the way over. You're just going to put it midway, and then you're going to pull it out into a little, I guess, like triangle shape and it looks dark but trust me it is not going to stay that way forever so you got your black on a little bit it looks bold and funky next you want to take a blender brush and this is by LA Colors, and it's just an um, eyeshadow blender brush. And you want to take a gray. And I'm using the third gray right here where my brush is in the BH88 um, Cosmetics video. And basically, you just want to get you some gray. And this is going to be your highlight. Like, you're not going to use any highlight color. This is it. So basically, you're going to like put this on the rest of your eye, and you are just going to blend. And as you see, that black starts to get toned it down some. You just blend, and you just blend, and you just keep on blending. So when all else uh, all else fails and let's say you're not getting the results that you want fast enough you just take your another blending brush and just blend it as much as you can and you're going to pick up some more gray because you want the gray to show a lot more but basically you just blend then you take your blending brush again, pick up some more gray, your brush that you was using for gray, and you're going to sweep that gray over, and then you're just going to like, see, 
now I have that effect going on on both eyes. You're just going to put some more gray on top of what you already did. And your red may look like it's faded out, but you can make that pop by going back and adding more red. I always like to just add more red anyway because red is one of those colors that people don't wear. I'm so sorry for my camera. Don't wear on their lids. So now, you have both eyes blended out. You're looking pretty fly. What's the next step? Well, you're going to take some liquid eyeliner. It doesn't have to be the expensive kind. I'm using the Eyes Lips Face Liquid Eyeliner. And I'm not good with lining my eyes with liquid eyeliner. But I, always, I do know that you start from the outside and work your way in. So don't worry about your little wing. Just worry about lining the eye and try to stay close to your lashes. Like this is the part that I suck at. But so once that is pretty much done, you're going to take a little bit and see how I looped it a little bit on that side. You're going to close your eye and loop this side a little bit. Not much, just a little bit. And you can draw a thicker line if you want for that dramatic boom effect. So, yeah. And what you're going to do is you're going to take some and you're going to line your waterline. This is a lot easier for me. So, I'm sorry about my camera. Oh my gosh. Okay. So, once both lines are um, lined, you take um, your mascara, and as always, I am using my Clinique High Volume um, Mascara. And basically, you're just going to do one coat of mascara, not two like what you normally do. And I normally don't make a boo-boo with mascara, but since this, the, it is like liquid eyeliner, like you hit something and then you try to hurry up and move something. So basically, just whatever, wherever you have a mess at, just clean it up. And this is the look. It's bold. It's funky. It's cute. Um... It's like a smoky eye, if that's what you want to call it. But here's the look up close. And one, you know, it just really depends on you and how you like your eyeshadow. And basically, guys, that's all that I have for today. I hope that you enjoyed this tutorial. Please rate, comment, and subscribe. And thank you so much for watching. Bye.